History is littered with conspiracies. So two examples from recent times would be the uh, weapons of mass destruction conspiracy theory um, and an, that, that basically led to the death of over a million Iraqis. And um, I, I guess a corporate one would be the Volkswagen emission scandal. So bad people will want to try to um, conspire, pull the wool over people's eyes in order to uh, profit from it in some way. Or, or maybe they're just, they're just downright evil people and they enjoy uh, committing acts of evil. So I just thought I'd, I found this in this, um, this popular book. Um, so I'll just read some of this here. So it says, uh, For there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed, neither hid that shall not be known. So I, I firmly believe that is that most conspiracies, it's just a matter of time before those that are doing the conspiring get discovered. Um, you know, so if you think about um, WMD or... Um, it was just a matter of time before, you know, <laughs> they did the invasion, which is what they wanted, and um, they couldn't find the WMD, and then the conspiracy was exposed. Uh, next, next bit says, Therefore, whatsoever you have spoken in darkness shall be heard in the light, and that what you have spoken in the ear in closets shall be proclaimed upon the housetops. So, you know, for me, I just think about um, that, that recent conference in Glasgow that a lot of the world's leaders, in fact, they're not leaders, they're just puppets, aren't they? They're just front people. So they went to Glasgow to be told um, what they were going to do next in the, uh, in the Divic 91 uh, totalitarian takeover. Now, you know, so there was um, uh, no minutes were ever taken of these meetings, you know. So, yes, it was likened to kind of people whispering in each other's ears. It wasn't known to the public what went on there. Um, same with what used to happen with Bilderberger meetings, same with um, World Economic Forum um, get-togethers at Davos. Uh, yeah, big industrialists who run the world get together. The politicians are invited also, not because the politicians are actually in charge of anything. They're just the front men who just make the announcements. Um, you know, and what, and what the Bible here, this is Luke uh, chapter 12, verse 3. What this is basically saying is that it's just a matter of time before all of this stuff gets in, uncovered. And I'm firmly, I firmly believe that. That's what history says. You know, you might be able to keep things secret for a while, but as that, that, that famous phrase that we all know, the truth will out eventually. And I, I firmly believe this is the case. And it will, I think it will come about quite quickly. Um, because of the control group, you know, um, Lagarde, I think, um, mentioned, oh no, it was von der Leyen mentioned uh, by accident that there's a 150 million strong control group in Western Europe. So, as I've said before, um, this winter time, just watch yourself. The the uh, the un the, those that haven't been to the Britney Spears will be um, healthy. They won't be uh, dropping dead of uh, peri-peri coincidites or um, they won't be getting the worst cold ever. Um, but in contrast, those that have been to um, repeatedly to the Britney Spears concerts, they'll either be, uh, well, sadly dead or suffering um, from a whole range of health problems. And I think including cancer as well, that, that, will, that will come. I'm, I'm sure, um, you know, because ideally they would like um, to, to kill people off at a, at a fairly sort of uh, gentle pace over, you know, to get their 70% reduction in pop population um, for sustainable development that, um, that the websites like Dialga was um, uh, prophesizing. Uh, so m m moving on here. Um, and I, so... It, so in the next section, it says, And I say unto you, my friends, be not afraid of them that kill the body. And after that, have no more that they can do. Now, again, I, you know, I read this and I thought, yeah, um, this is this is striking a chord for me. You know, we've seen their worst, you know, um, which is mandates. If you don't go to the Britney Spears, 
you know, we'll, we'll kind of like lock you up in prison and like effectively end your life here. And, and what the Bible is basically saying here is, is that it doesn't really matter. You know, they can kill the body. What matters is your soul, the destination of your soul. Yeah, so it's this, this phrase, isn't it? Not black lives matter. No, no, no. Not even no lives matter. No, no, no. This is eternal lives matter. The, the, des the final destination of your soul. So uh, verse 5 says, But I will forewarn you whom you shall fear. Fear him, that's God, which after he hath killed hath power to cast into hell. Ye, I say unto you, fear him. And I think that that's, that's right. That, you know, I'm, I'm not really, um, you know, we don't get to live very long anyway. Uh, what was it, three score and ten or, you know, 80 years. Life expectancy has been dropping for a while. Um, as time goes on, you know, I can only sort of speak personally. I just feel less connected um, to this world and more connected to, uh, the, I don't know, the fact that... Um, I'm born in God's image as you are and this is just a temporary I suppose it's a test really I think that's another thing that you know that I've been reading again and again and again in the Bible in various sections is that you know we are being tested and the the, the wheat is being uh, sifted from the chaff and this is what this this whole phase of human history is about I think and, and the people uh, who are um, preparing to sell their soul for a skiing holiday you know they're the chaff um anyway um yeah so uh, that's all i want to say really um so you can see out here i've got a flagpole a lot of finnish houses have flagpoles and um we're coming towards the shortest day of the year and um it's warmed up a lot now it's like four or five degrees plus so we've had a 25 degree change in temperature uh, but I would much rather have it minus 20 in blue sky because we've got like more like an English winter's day. It's like grey. So anyway, God bless you all.